It's merely just covering my nipple. All the rest of my titty is, look, it's not doing anything for me. So, but I mean, I still like it. I mean, I wore it. I think I wore it on, the last time I wore this was, we were going out for my birthday to a concert, me, Ken, and my auntie and them. And I had this on with my boots. I have some boots that match this. And so we were doing it like that. So I had that on that day. But, anywho, um, I just simply wanted to come on right quick and show you guys, you know, what's up on the corset thing. Now, this one here... Mo, I'll send you this one. If you want this, if you want this color, Mo, I'll send you this one. It's never been worn. It has been tried on, but it's never been worn. And it is a, it's a 38, though. You see what I'm saying? So, I don't know if, if it'll fit you, mama. This corset is yours. It has not been worn. Here's the G that goes to it. It has not never been worn at all. But if you want a corset, mama, as your girl, I got you. And I'll front you your first corset. So, I have to see where are the... I think I was going to wear it one day. I was going to wear it one day. Me and Kim were going somewhere and I was going to wear it. And um, I got to find the garter belt. The little garter straps. I don't know where they are. But anyway, if you want this one, Mama, hit me up. And you just in Moval. And boom, you can have this one right here. It's springtime. It's a spring color. This is bomb. Especially, like, and see, let me show you guys something else. Hold on. Now, you know, to rock a nice peasant skirt, you know, like this, you know, the nice long peasant skirts. I was rocking peasant skirts like this with my corsets and, you know, my, my skirt fit low. Y'all, I was rocking it. And I had my little peasant skirt on. But see, this is just a shorter one and this is a longer one here. And um, I just washed it, turned them inside out and done it moving. But it's just a regular little peasant skirt. Okay, but it's long. It's like ankle length. I was rocking the peasant skirt, corset, because see, what you want to do is if you're going to don something like this, I wonder what happened to my blue. I hope ain't nobody done got my ass because I had a, a real pretty, y'all, this blue that I got is so off the chain. It got, I think it's at Ken's house, but it's a real beautiful, beautiful blue, real pretty blue. And I know I um I wore it. Snoop and them were having a little function, like a little party that they were having. And I wore it there. And so I think that was the last time I wore it. And then I was going to wear it. Me and Kenny were going somewhere. And I had wore it for that. And um, no, I was going to wear it with Ken, but I didn't wear it with Ken. But me and Ken were going somewhere and I was going to wear the blue because that's his favorite color. So I was going to don the blue for that. But I didn't do it. And so I just haven't. But anyway, y'all. But this is the corset. This is how they fit. And this is the fit that you want. This is the fit. You want it to, you know, confirm to your figure. If it's not confirming to your figure, that means it's not fitting right. It's supposed to accentuate your curves. You're not supposed to be able to pull nothing like this. With the other night with this on. And see, I really need to take it in more. Because look how tight the strings are. And I still had room in there. That's why it did not confirm. Because see, your strings are not supposed to be that close together. It's supposed to be gapped. I don't know how big the gap is on this. But you want it to be gapped apart. A good like maybe an inch apart. You know, about two inches. And that's when you know that it's fitting. 
When, when, when they're too close together like this, the way it was the other night, it's too big. Because the corset is, you're supposed to be able to see it lace up. Now, I want to make sure my, because I ain't got no panties on. Y'all know that. So I'm trying not to show y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying not to, you know what I'm saying? It's not that type of video. You understand what I'm saying? Leave that shit for the other chicks. But, y'all, because mama done lost a little bit of weight, you know. So my shorts, these are my ex's shorts. And you see how they're fitting, you know what I mean? So I'm trying to, you know, trying to keep that all that up. But anyway, but yeah, you don't want, when you see that the strings are that close together, like right here, they're too close together. This corset wasn't fitting. And though I did take it in, it needs to be taken in a little bit more so that it'll fit me properly. Now, see, this 38 right here fits me good. This fits me really good because it's a 38. So, a lot of times you'll go and you'll buy corsets and they, like, when you get to Frederick's and if they have just the 42s, the 44s and stuff like that, I'll buy those and I'll just take those in too because I need something that's going to fit me properly. So, anyway, family, I just wanted to come in right quick, show you guys the corsets, how to work them, plus give out a shout out to my girl Mo. Let her know I got her. I got you, mommy, on that first um, corset. This one is yours. So just hit me with your info. And um, Mama sending this to you. Yeah. Shit, perhaps we can meet up at the tobacco lounge and do our corset thing. Because I already know how you do it already. So then therefore, hey, we can make this a little date hookup. You put your corset on, Mama put her corset on, and we go ahead on and let them have it down there at the tobacco lounge. It ain't shit to me. What else I got to do? You know what I'm saying? So anyway, holla at your girl. I do have your telephone number. I think I do. I think I do have, no. I think the number that I don't have, the same number I have, I don't think that's the same number anymore. So, holla at me. Give me your info on where to send this to. And then I got you on that. Anyway, family, I guess I'm out on this one. Um, I did get a lot of messages where folks want me to try on that, um, uh, that little net thing I bought, and I really want to try it on, but I think what I'm going to do is, when I do that fitness video for you guys, the before and after, and show you guys where I'm starting at and all that other stuff, and do my weight and all that, then I'm going to probably put on something like that, a swimsuit, or you know, something like that, and um, so I can get an accurate measurement and all that other. So anyway, family, I just wanted to come in right quick, share that with my girl Mo. Put the rest of my girls up on the uh, corset game. And on that note, family, I am out. Let me get this shit off. Because, and let me tell you another thing about this right here. When you're doing this, sitting down, let me show you. You want to do the bar stools at the club. For real. When, when you have your corset on, you're supposed to just sit down like you a fucking statuette. I'm serious. Because, like, okay, now I can sit down, which means I'm comfortable. This might not be a comfortable for somebody else, but I can sit down. But really, when I'm in a club, you know, I do a lot of the, the bar stools. Like, I'll sit on a bar stool. You know, pop that hip out a little bit where that's like, ba bam bam You know, with a little curve. I'm fast. I'm fast. But, yeah, that's how I do it. I pop the little hip out like that. Bam. You know, a little, give it a little side view, a little, little curvature right there. And I'm just on some statuette. You feel me? Yeah. So, anyway, family, let me go ahead on and tie, uh, take all this shit out because I feel like I'm tired the fuck up. So, let me take this off and um, I shall uh, get up with you guys in a little bit. I love you guys dearly. Deuces. Love you. Bye.